fruit. Oh, and you're in that one. Oh boy. Oh boy. What's up? We're back for another one. I'm your king, the whiskey king. I'm here to give you some kingly advice, and this is my jester. Oh! Whoa! Yo, yeah, so I'm rocking the new silver crown. You guys voted, and today we're bringing it out. Decided to switch it up. Sill. Sill. That's an interesting. So we got some real special shit going on today. Friend of mine, you know, there you go. Cooteries. I think you're explaining too much. His work associate's wife has a charcuterie business. Charcuterie is a French term that describes pairings of meat, cheeses, grapes, basically a board of goodies that will pair well with typically uh, a wine. We paired it with a whiskey, but not just any whiskey. We paired it with a whiskey that was finished for 46 days in a Dakota Shy Napa Valley Atlas cask. And you're probably thinking, what the hell is all that? This is her charcuterie board. She puts lots of effort. There is a King's Crown cut cheese in here. She did the tulip uh, technique with the different meats. There is a ton of stuff. So. Yeah. It looks absolutely fantastic. It smells fantastic. She does them custom made. Whatever you want, she'll make it. It's incredible stuff. Yeah. We're going to get into each ingredient she has it listed for us. Make sure to follow her on Instagram. Huge shout out for real. Now, what we have it paired with is the Hill Rock Atlas Cask. Okay, so this is their Solera bourbon. If you want to know more about Hill Rock, go back and watch episode two. We have a specific video of the Hill Rock State Distillery Tour where we got an interview with the owners. So this Atlas Cask is a really incredible one. We're talking high 90s in the point system for a wine advocate rating. Okay, Napa Valley, incredible terroir, estate grown, using the terroir of the Hudson Valley and then combining the two, because you get the terroir of the Hudson Valley in the whiskey and the terroir of Napa Valley from the wine. We're using that Atlas cask. Um, I've had some before on its own and it's unbelievable. It is fantastic. This one is coming in at 56.9%. Yeah. As you can check this out. I'll turn it towards the camera. <laughs> Pretty much the sweetest glass you can obtain in your life ever. Laser engraved whiskey Glencairn. Yeah. It is specifically designed to enhance your whiskey experience by the shape. Yep. So it, it allows it to expand on the bottom. It comes up to a narrower profile on the top. So that way when you nose it, it pushes all of the flavor straight to your nose. And it allows you to swish. Links in the bio. You want one, we'll hook it up. You could also DM me. I got them for sale. If you like what we're doing, a way to support us is buy a glass. And yeah. then you can too could feel like a king in your own home. Exactly. Drinking whiskey. Exactly. Cheers, buddy. Let's get into this whiskey and pair it up. Shit. Oh, dude. It's it's an instant blast <laughs> of that Napa <laughs> wine flavor. Like mixed with fruits and berries. <laughs> Cinnamon, vanilla, uh, almost like a cream brulee dessert. Some barrel notes. That's an instant thumbs up. Yeah. Come on, you kidding me? It's gone through oh. so many barrels between the Solera process and the Atlas cast finish. This is world class. Now, the one that they did with the Homer cask, that recently won some double gold medals. So the stuff that Hell Rock is putting out, it's incredible. This is available on their website, Shop Hill Rock. It's $130 plus tax and shipping. I recommend you go and get it. They recently released it. Um, they could ship direct to you if you live in New York. If you don't live in New York, then you're gonna need to go to your local liquor store and try to have it sourced. They could ship it out for you from there. 
I mean, if you really want to taste the taste of New York, oh. like a good New York whiskey, but you like that wine flavor as well. Mm -hmm. Palette is fantastic. Mm. And that's just the initial sip. Similar to what I got on the nose with getting on the palate, it's an initial burst of that wine, oh. followed by raspberry, uh, strawberries, uh, a little desserty, but really heavily influenced by that wine. Um, some dark berries coming through, vanilla, cinnamon, clove, nutmeg. Yep. A little Dude, vanilla. Incredible. Incredible palate. And the finish on this, it comes back in mm. more on the back end with that wine on the back yeah. end. And, and just, once it really starts settling in, the wine And then just starts. blast out. Thumbs up on the palate, you'd agree? Yeah. Yeah. But they're, they're coming out with great stuff, mm. you know? Every single time, they do not disappoint with their new release. We need to give it its proper due. Whoa. You know what I'm thinking. Whoa. You know what I'm thinking. Whoa. Shit, shit. It's a banger when you give it the sticker and you slap the shit out of it. So let's get into this charcuterie and see if it makes it even better. We got prosciutto, cucumber dill spread, manchego, copa, apricot, apple smoked cheddar, pear date cognac chutney, aged iris cheddar, pepperoni. Uh, she cuts it up so nice. All you Whiskey King boys, like if you live on Long Island or something, and you want to have her whoa, cater for you. Yeah. Have Just call her up and set it up. Tell her what you want. If you have any specific things you like. Even if you don't even know what you want. Right. Like, look what, what, what she can produce for you. Mm. Mm. Oh, dude, it's even better. I know. Holy With the pear, shit. That's what I'm saying. With the brie. Oh. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Mm. Mm. Oh. Oh, oh, oh. Wow. Mm. Gonna get some aged cheddar and meat. Oh. Chutney. Dude, that chutney. It makes the whiskey pop warm. So I got a question for you. Uh. Are you normally a charcuterie kind of guy? No. I never many, eat this. How many times have you had this type of food? Like once? Even though the jester is new to charcuterie, I'm not. I've been doing charcuterie for years. And I understand the finesse to be able to cut this all up, make it pretty, and also pair certain things together. Oh, no, that's no. Not. It's a perfect pairing here. The uh, brie with that sauce, right? Mm. Ridiculous. Because it adds like a salty brine yeah. taste to it. Oh, and you're adding that on. Good call. Dude, you're really going in on that salty, sauce. Salty, briny, and like fruity, cheesy, and a little bit of meat. <laughs> So I think we should talk about our other sponsor. PG Naturals. PG Naturals. Yo, tell them about it. It's pure CBD. Drop it to the other day, fell asleep like a baby, put me right into that deep sleep. PGNaturals.com. You're gonna get 10% off your order. Yeah. If you use our promo code, which is Whiskey Kings. It cures a lot of shit. <laughs> don't, don't mind the just the stomach. <laughs> Will this thing cure gas? Uh, squirt some in my mouth. Let's see. Right, let's see. Is it gonna cure the gas? Uh, uh, ew! <laughs> Shit! <laughs> 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 Fuck! You're enjoying great pours with charcuterie. Take the CBD at a later like time during the day. Wash down some whiskey. Eat it slow, drink responsibly. Thank you for joining us. Yeah, yeah. Also hit the like and subscribe, you know, show some love to yeah, us. Come on. Know. And hit that bell notification so you Dude. know when we got more coming out. Till next time, boys. Cheers. Cheers. Yeah. Woo!